that's a really huge milestone for SpaceX and certainly for the space industry. Um, no one has ever soft landed uh, a liquid rocket boost stage before. Uh, and uh, I think this bodes very well for achieving reusability. As people have maybe heard me say, I think what what SpaceX has done thus far is evolutionary, but, but not revolutionary. Um, and I think if, if we can make, um, if, if we can recover the stage intact and relaunch it, the potential is there for a truly revolutionary impact in space transport, transport costs. With, with each successive launch, and we have several more launches this year, we expect to get more and more uh, precise with the landing. And if all goes well, um, I am optimistic that we'll be able to land the stage back at Cape Canaveral by the end of the year. So that's all, all great stuff, and I think, assuming that happens, we should be able to, to refly the, the main boost stage sometime next year. Uh, anyways, it's, it's somewhat of a huge day because we've been trying to do this at SpaceX for a long time, and it's been 12 years, and we've, we've sort of finally did it. Um, and uh, now we're just going to bring it back home in one piece.